Hey everyone, it's Ashley from Yoga For That. I'm here today to offer a nice back opening sequence. So whether you're feeling tight or heavy through the back area, this sequence will help to loosen up the spine and hopefully have you feeling a little less tight by the end of the sequence. We'll start off in a seated meditation today. So if you'd like, you're more than welcome to sit up on one or both of your blocks, or you can sit on your heels. Drawing the tailbone down, low belly drawing in, resting the hands, palms up, or palms down on the thighs, then softly closing the eyes. Allowing yourself to arrive into this space. Letting go of any stress or tension you might be holding in your body or your mind. Taking the three more rounds of cleansing breath. One more big breath in, exhale, let it go. Drawing the chin down towards the chest. And from here, taking the hands to the nape of the neck and interlacing our hands at the neck. Keeping the back nice and long, drawing the tailbone down. As you inhale, begin to open the chest without arcing the back. And as you exhale, begin to round your spine and draw the elbows towards one another. Inhale to open the chest. Option this time to take the arc, seated cat-cow. Exhale to round the spine. Inhale to open wide. Exhale to round the spine. One more time. Inhale to open. Exhale to round and pause here, not holding the breath, but breathing in between the shoulder blades. As you exhale, release the hands down towards your thighs, bringing the gaze forward. Inhale to reach the hands up. And as you exhale, begin to twist open towards the right. Inhale to come through center. Exhale to twist to the left. Inhale through center. Exhale to twist. Two more. Inhale. Exhale. Last time. Inhale. And exhale. Finishing off this round. Inhale. Arms come up. Exhale. Inhale to draw the arms through center. Exhale, release the hands behind you and clasp the hands together. Draw the fist down towards the earth as you begin to broaden the heart forward and the gaze might come up towards the sky. Still drawing the tailbone down, lifting tall to the chest and finding the breath along the collarbones. As you exhale, begin to gaze forward, release your hands. Inhale to reach the arms up. And as you exhale, release the hands towards the floor as you shift off the heels. Place the block out of your way and make your way to tabletop. Coming to meet in your tabletop shape, hands outer shoulder distance apart, pressing evenly through all four corners of your hands. Shoulders stacked over your wrists, knees under your hips, and toes can be tucked or untucked. Take a big breath in. Exhale, side out. Inhale to lift your tailbone, open the heart. Exhale to round the spine. Two more here, inhale. And exhale. Last time, inhale. And exhale to round. 
As you inhale, release to a neutral spine. Walk your hands one to two palm distances forward. Shift your shoulders over your wrists. Toes are tucked. Engage your core. Lift your hips up and back. Downward dog. Taking a moment here to walk your dog out, bending into one knee and pressing back through the opposite heel. Noticing how it feels to be upside down today, anchoring through your palms, lengthening the tailbone to the wall behind you, cleansing breath in and out. Inhale to come high on the toes. Bend the knees, exhale, walk, step, or hop towards the front edge of your mat. Inhale to find length, halfway lift. Exhale, fold over the legs, forward fold and hold. Bring the weight equal to all four corners of your feet. Soften your knees enough to rest your belly on your thighs. Relax through the crown of the head and use the heaviness of your head to begin opening up into the back line of the body. Hands can rest or grab for opposite elbows. And here you might sway side to side or forward and back. Releasing to still release your hands to the floor. Inhale to lengthen halfway. Exhale to plant your palms. Step back to your plank foundation. Pause in your plank. Anchor through your palms. Press your foot away to find a rounding between the shoulder blades. Draw your low belly and reach a longer through your heel. Big breath in. Exhale, side out. Inhale to shift forward from your toes. Knees or toes lower all the way down to the earth. Untuck your toes. Press through the tops of the feet and as you inhale, lift your heart forward and up, baby cobra. Exhale to release. Inhale to lift the chest, baby cobra. Exhale to release. Last time, inhale, baby cobra or full cobra, broaden your heart. Exhale to release. Tuck your toes, come through hands and knees or plank, meeting in your downward dog. Inhale to come high on your toes. Bend the knees, exhale, walk, step or hop forward. Inhale to lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale to release. Inhale to red, all to stand, rising one vertebrae at a time, nice and slow and controlled. Draw the shoulders towards the ear, shoulders draw down the back, palms face forward, mountain pose. Inhale to reach the hands up, gaze might follow. Exhale to dive over the thighs, forward fold. Inhale to find length, halfway lift. Exhale to plant your palms, step back to plank. Shift forward from your toes. Knees or toes lower all the way down to the earth. Untuck your toes. Inhale, baby cobra or full cobra. Exhale, press it back, downward dog. Inhale, come high on your toes. Bend your knees. Exhale, step, walk or hop forward. Inhale to lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale to release. Inhale to reverse swan dive to stand, reach the hands towards the sky, gentle back bend. Exhale, hands through heart center. Release the hands beside you. Inhale to reach the arms up, gaze might follow. Exhale to dive forward fold. Inhale to find length, halfway lift. Exhale to plant your palms, step back to plank. Shift forward from your toes, lower halfway or all the way down. Inhale, cobra or upward dog. Pressing back, downward dog. Big breath in. Exhale, let it go. Inhale to come high on your toes. Bend the knees, so walk, step, or hop forward. Inhale to find length, halfway lift. Exhale to release. Inhale to rest, reach the hands towards the sky. Exhale, hands draw through heart center. Release the hands beside you. Walk your big toes together to touch. Little bit of space between your heels. 
Inhale to sink the weight into your heels. Sink your hips down and back. Chair pose, hands at heart center. With an inhale, anchor through your heels. Hook your thumbs, reach up towards the sky. Gentle back bend. Exhale to chair pose. Inhale to rise. Gentle back bend. Exhale to flow. Last time, inhale to rise. Exhale to flow, pause and chair, big breath in. Exhale, fold over the thighs, straighten the legs. Inhale to halfway lift. Exhale to plant your palms, step back to plank. Optional vinyasa, meeting in your downward dog. Inhale, right leg lifts high. Stepping your right foot to your right thumb, help it forward if you need to, knee stacks over ankle, left knee down to the floor, and option to untuck the back toes. Inhale to rise, low lunge. Sending your front knee forward, draw your right hip back, left hip forward. With an exhale, begin to twist open towards the right. Inhale to come through center. Exhale to twist. Inhale through center. Last time, exhale to twist. Inhale to reach your left arm forward. Option to tuck your back toes, lift the back knee off the floor, scissor the legs towards one another. Inhale, higher low lunge, arms come up. Exhale, hands to the floor. Plant your left palm, step your right leg on top of your left side plank. Using down, forward, or to the sky, hips lift higher. Exhale, top hand to the floor, plank foundation. Inhale, hips up and back, downward dog. Inhale, left leg lifts high. Exhale, step, left foot to left thumb, help it forward if you need to. Right knee to the floor, option to untuck the back toes. Inhale, low lunge. Sinking deeper into your front knee, draw the low belly in. Exhale to twist open to the left. Inhale to come through center. Exhale to twist. Inhale through center. Exhale to twist. Inhale to reach the right arm forward, pausing here. Or option to tuck the back toes, lift the back knee. Scissor the legs towards one another, engage the core. Inhale to rise, high lunge. Exhale, hands to the earth. Plant your right palm, send your left leg on top of the right. Side plank, lift the hips nice and high, gazing down, forward, or to the sky. Exhale, top hand to the floor. Inhale, hips up and back, downward dog. Inhale, high on the toes. Bend the knees, exhale, walk, step, or hop four. Inhale to lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale to release. Taking the peace fingers to your big toes. Inhale to lengthen, halfway. As you exhale, fold over the thighs, take your elbows wide, relax the crown of the head. Pull up on your toes as you press your toes into your fingers. Big breath in. Exhale, release your toes. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, release. Plant your palms. Step back to your plank foundation. Shift forward from your toes. Knees or toes lower all the way down to your belly. Untuck your toes. Walk your hands to your low ribs. Inhale to lift your heart off the floor. Exhale to release. Inhale to lift your legs off the floor. Exhale to release. Inhale, lift everything, maybe even the palms off the earth. Exhale to release. Inhale to lift everything. Exhale to release. Last time, inhale to lift everything. Exhale to release. Rest your arms along beside you. Rest your right cheek 
to the earth. Allow your shoulders to roll down. Bring the knees through center and then left cheek to earth. Inhale through center. Hands come underneath your shoulders. Press yourself back. Child's pose. Knees together or knees apart. Your choice. Belly resting on or between the thighs. Arms can reach forward or back. Walking your hands towards your knees as you inhale to come up to seated. Shifting over to one hip and sending the feet out in front of you. <clears throat> Big toes together to touch. Squeeze the knees and inner thighs towards one another. Sitting up nice and tall. Always option hands can come behind your thighs. Begin to lean back, engage your core, and then option two is to lift your toes off the earth. Option three, hands can come to heart. Press your palms down the shoulders, down the back, chest lifts proud. Keep squeezing the legs together. As you exhale, draw your left knee to right elbow. Inhale to come through center. Exhale to twist. Inhale through center. Last two, exhale. Inhale, last time, exhale. Inhale through center, release your hands as you exhale. Inhale to straighten your legs, lift the chest proud. Exhale to release, surround out the spine. Give yourself a nice big hug. As you are ready, Feeling free to swing your legs over to one side. Come to meet back in your tabletop shape. Toes can be tucked or untucked. Always option to roll the mat underneath the knees as well if you need extra support in this shape. Reach your right arm out in front of you. Draw your left leg back. Point the toes to the earth. Draw the heel towards the boot and then point the toes towards the sky. You can pause here. Or you might reach back with your right hand and grab for the top of the foot. Anchor through your left palm so you're not sinking into your shoulder. And then begin to kick your foot into your hand, broaden your heart and your chest. Exhale to release to the earth. Big breath in. Exhale, let it go. Reach the left arm forward. Extend through your right leg to point the toes down. Draw the heel towards the glute and then point the toes towards the sky. You might reach back, grab for the top of the foot. Anchor through your planted palm and then kick your foot into your hand. Exhale to release to the earth. Big breath in. Exhale, side it out. Walk your hands nice and wide. Suck your toes, lift your hips up and back. Downward dog. Big breath in. Exhale, side it out. Bending into your knees. Begin to walk your hands towards your feet, coming towards the back edge of your mat. Inhale to find length, halfway lift. Exhale to release. Heel to the feet as wide as your mouth. Toes point out, heels draw in, and then drop the bottom in between your knees. Send the triceps into your inner thighs, inner thighs into your triceps, press your palms, heart reaches into your thumbs. And if you feel congested in your hip area, feel free to walk your feet wider for more space in the hips. Feeling free to rock side to side, forward and back, whatever feels available in this shape. One more big breath in. Exhale to fold over your thighs, forward fold, point your toes forward. 
Inhale to lengthen. Exhale to bend your knees and walk yourself out to a wide stance plank foundation. Take a big breath in. Exhale, hips up and back, wide stance, downward dog. And then step your feet back to hip distance. Inhale to lift your right leg high. Exhale to step your right foot in between your hands. Rotating your back heel down. Inhale to rise up. Warrior two. Sink nice and deep into your front knee. Reaching your arms nice and long. These over your front middle finger. As you inhale, lengthen out of your hips. Exhale to reach back. Exalted warrior. Inhale to come through. Warrior two. Sink deeper. Exhale. Exalted warrior. Inhale, warrior two, a little bit deeper. Exhale, reach it back, exalted warrior. Maybe take the hand to the back of the head and reach your left arm underneath your low back towards your front hip. Sink deeper. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, windmill your hands towards the earth. Lift your back heel, step back to plank. Optional vinyasa. Meeting in your downward dog. Inhale, left leg lifts high. Exhale to step your left foot in between your hands. Rotate your back heel down. Inhale to rise, warrior two. Settle into your pose, reaching out of your fingers. Inhale to lengthen. Exhale to reach it back, exalt warrior. Inhale to warrior two. Sink deeper, exhale, reach, reach it back. Inhale, warrior two, sink even deeper. Exhale, reach it back. Right arm underneath, reaching for your front hip, maybe left hand to the nape of the neck. Lean the weight of your head into your hand to find the stretch in your chest. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, windmill the hands to the floor, lift your back heel, step it back. Optional vinyasa, meeting in your downward dog. Big breath in. Exhale, knees release to the earth, knees together or apart. Press it back, child's pose. You're welcome to draw your elbows to the floor. Take the hands to the nape of the neck. Release your hands to the earth. Walk yourself back for tabletop shape. Tuck your toes, lifting your hips up and back. Downward. Begin to walk your hands towards your feet, coming towards the back edge of your mat one more time. Inhale to lengthen, halfway lift. Exhale to release. Heel to the feet as wide as your mat. We've been here before. We're coming back. Toes out, heels in, and drop the bottom between the knees. If you need that extra support, you're welcome to sit up on a block as you need. Take the triceps to your inner thighs, inner thighs to your triceps. You're welcome to stay here. We'd like to take this a little bit further. Taking your peace fingers to your right big toe and then opening the left arm towards the left. Releasing the left hand back to heart center in prayer resetting. Then taking the left peace fingers to the left big toe, reach out through your right arm. Draw your hand back through center in prayer. Big breath in. Exhale to stay. Releasing your tippy fingers to the earth. Inhale to press to your heels. Point your toes forward and begin to heel toe your feet together to touch. Come high up your heels. Take your knees wide. Palms rest underneath the shoulders. Anchor through your palms. Lift your, knee, your hips nice and high. Draw the elbows in towards your shins. And begin to lean the body weight forward while keeping your knees forward, floating one or maybe both feet off the earth into crow. 
Taking a few rounds of breath here and as you're ready, releasing down and coming to meet in a child's pose. Walking your hands towards your knees, coming to sit up on your shins, and then sending your legs over to one side and come to meet on the back. Slow the feet to the earth, roll the shoulders underneath you. Drawing the right knee towards the chest, bring the right ankle to your left thigh. Option one, pretzel stretch. Option two, thread the needle. You might begin to move your legs laterally, noticing how that changes the stretch for you. Releasing your left foot to the floor, arms return to cactus. Wrap your right leg over the left. Shift your hips to the right and rotate your knees all the way to the left for a spinal twist. Draw yourself through to center, both feet to the floor, square the hips. Left knee draws in, left ankle to right thigh, again pretzel stretch or thread the needle your choice. Releasing your foot back to the floor, wrapping your left leg over the right, shift your hips over to the left, and rotate the knees to the right for your spinal twist. As you inhale, draw yourself through center. Both feet to the earth, squaring the hips. Taking the feet together to touch, knees come nice and wide. Option to take happy baby, or you could keep your feet on the earth if the low back is feeling quite open. And begin to arrive into your natural breath. Letting go of anything that's built up during your practice, or anything you are still holding on to. As you are ready, releasing down into your final resting position, whatever that looks like today. Allow yourself to relax into your final shape. Allow your tongue to fall away from the roof of your mouth. Softening through the jaw. Relaxing through your shoulders, your hips.
beginning to deepen the breath. Allowing movement to return into your fingers and your toes. Creating circles with the wrists and the ankles. Drawing your left foot to the earth, followed by the right. And choose to roll to the right or left side of your body. And then press yourself up to your final seated position. As you make your way to seated, sitting cross-legged or sitting on your heels, on or off a block as you wish, eyes open or eyes closed. Drawing the hands to prayer at heart center. Bowing the head down towards the hands. May the light in me find the light in you. Namaste. Thank you so much for practicing with me today. Until next time, namaste.